uh, another day YouTube y'all so today's a different type of video um i've been talking about getting a daily for a minute now and i know my car is kind of loud but today might be the day um i'm about to go see a wagon now wagons have been i've been falling in love with the wagons i like how they look done up so i've been looking at one recently and no i did not expect to get a daily this quick i was actually gonna wait till fall but I will explain later how I am making this possible and shout out to my dad because he is the GOAT. So just I'm really thinking I need to invest in a GoPro because maybe some point of view driving without holding the camera in my hand to speak to you guys is maybe a little bit better. But like I said, we're going to get it daily. Right now I have to stop, make a few stops before I go see the car. And I actually have my boy JP coming with me. So JP you watch this shout out to you as always my guy you always coming through clutch but yeah like i said we're gonna go check out the car now i don't know if i'm leaving with the car today um i have my front plate that i don't run on my super that i could possibly throw on the wagon if we do get it today so i've been searching all week for a damn wagon but like i said i'll go over like everything picking up my dog jp just in case anything goes smooth he drives the wagon back as soon as jp come out we're gonna go check out this car i think i already said what it is so hopefully we get a good deal if not we talk her down still get a good deal oh shout out to my guy yeah, yeah yo you, <laughs> secured Maybe a real beamer boy now a little bit kind of falling in love with beamers <laughs> soon it'll be porsches yeah hey yo once you get that alignment, this shit's gonna drive so much better, bro. Yeah, you think yeah, so? I was kind of fighting for control of the wheel. Well, Super got a sister. Or nah, I should say her brother. But yeah. Let's welcome to 325 XI to the channel. It's gonna need some work, but got it for a good price. 2900 and it has 140k miles on it, so... Shout out to the person who sold me it. This is very nice and respectful and nothing but love from them. So shout out to you guys and new car on the channel. But them headlights gotta go for real. <laughs> well, we got a full house. Full house of cars. <laughs> but what is good YouTube? Today is the very next day, and I was actually supposed to take this to a show, but I decided not to. I decided I'm gonna stay home and not only record, but I'm going to clean up my newest, the newest member to the family, my 325 XI wagon. Finally, the Supra has a sibling, and no better sibling than a nice little Beamer wagon. They're slept on, not a lot of people have them, and I don't see a lot of them, but now that I have one, I guarantee you they're about to be everywhere. This is a 06 325 XI wagon. Now, I was looking over, all over, for wagons, and I just couldn't really find one for a good price, especially with the mileage. So this has 140,000 on the dash and no check engine light. Seems like it's been pretty well maintained. It's just been sitting. Um, it has new brakes all around, new tires. The inside is just a little dirty and all that. It was wired for music, but I had them remove the sub because I didn't really need it, nor am I really a music guy. Um, the interior is pretty good. It just needs to be cleaned. Really needs some TLC. Um, it's a couple things that is wrong with the car, not drive wise, just like on the outside that I already know I have to fix. And also the AC is not working in this car. It needs to be recharged. That's exactly what I'm so assuming. And it needs just about an oil change, but I just wanted to go over a few things that I already know 
that we're going to change and that I'm going to work on changing. So I got this off of Facebook Marketplace. Somebody nearby in Boston got it out from Dorchester. Um, originally on the post they wanted 4800 but we was able to talk them down to 29 so we got this wagon for 29,000 <laughs> for 2900 and it has 140k miles on it and it's actually in pretty decent condition besides this rear bumper I don't know if y'all can see that so off rip i already know i guess they tried to paint this i'm not too sure what the hell went on but this obviously i'd rather just it, it sits fine i'd rather just take it off completely and if i don't upgrade to a different style bumper i'll just get the same one and leave it unpainted just so this isn't like that and um yeah it seems like somebody tried to paint it and they did like a terrible job i'm just gonna debadge this whole thing call it a day um there's some buffing work that i'm gonna do to it especially on this side it has a couple of scratches here all along i just woke up so don't mind me either i'm in, I'm in shorts and some crocs it's nice and hot out it's about to be really hot today but yeah it's black so we all know could use a little buffing but we drove it yesterday it runs pretty good the mirrors fold in and I'm gonna don't worry I'm gonna start the car but as so you guys can see the front bumper now on both sides it is hit I don't know what the hell they hit but I'm just assuming a new bumper all around for the front and rear and I already been checking the price on that and it doesn't seem like it's gonna cost too too much and also I don't know this problem right here but the hood on this side is not closing fully so already that's another problem and you can see the bumper is not really clipped on right um they said they hit it like backing out of their driveway something like that like i said i'm not too worried about it i got this for a steal and these headlights gotta go headlights and taillights it's like they spray paint tinted them and i really don't like that look so um definitely new headlights and taillights and especially only one of these bulbs work i think that one blew but fog lights work pretty good and car overall it's not in bad condition but it's gonna need some minor touching like I said I gotta clean the interior so you guys can see yeah the interior needs like a whole fucking crazy ass cleaning um, I was gonna go ahead and take care of that today but other than that it's pretty car's pretty smooth has that sunroof problem but it's all good like i said we got it for 2900 so i'm not expecting it to be immaculate but this shit is pretty much dirty as hell and it needs to be like really freaking cleaned bad <laughs> car is actually really fucking dirty i should have talked them down some more but it's all good like i said and the AC doesn't work, so that's the only problem. Starts right up. Um, I need fucking gas. This is what the engine's looking like. I just think it needs some TLC. The car is fine. There's nothing really wrong with it, especially for its age and it being a Beamer. The drove smooth. Let me see if it closes properly. Nope. It's sitting. It's not sitting right. But, like I said, that could be easily fixed. But hundred forty six thousand miles on it. Um, I know this thing's gonna need an oil change. So yeah, what you guys think? Twenty nine hundred. Not a bad cop. Especially for a wagon. 
got some plans for her. It's gonna be my daily slash project. But you know me, whenever I have a car, I want it to look good and I'm always gonna modify it. So, pretty sure this won't be looking like this soon. Plus it's all wheel drive, especially for Boston winners. I should be good. So, I gotta speak to my insurance and figure out how much this thing is gonna be running me a month and then get it registered tomorrow. And then it should be on the road. And then the build starts from there. So yeah, two beamers. Who would have never thought a Honda boy would have went to beamer side? But yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. I also have a merch drop coming soon. I know we don't have like 10k subscribers, but that don't matter. Um, I got like a small supply of t-shirts that are coming out. And just want to give you guys a heads up, but I'll post when it's ready to drop. But it has basically this logo, top shot of logo on it, and a picture of my car, basically. But yeah, I'll talk more about that when the time is ready. But yeah, what do you guys think? 325XI wagon 06. This thing needs to be cleaned the fuck up. This shit is dirty. But yeah, man, that's gonna be the video. Quick simple video and I'm gonna just do a video of me probably cleaning the cars and getting it ready together but the Supra is filthy as well the colors just hiding it but I haven't watched this car in a long ass time probably like a week but yeah 